What's up guys, I'm doing a quick video response for Huff Boyardee here on YouTube. Some of you guys obviously know him. That's how I found him. I was linked by a friend on here and I appreciate that because he, uh, he doesn't have too many videos, but his stuff's fun. Uh, he's cool to watch, you know, and I think he's putting up more and more videos and stuff. I'm trying to encourage him to do some more as well. So he's a big Indians fan, obviously. You can see that in the background. So hit him up with the sub. It's kind of ridiculous. He's only at like 62 subs. That's kind of not cool in my book. So let's hook him up with some subs. But check out this contest. It's pretty cool. I'm about to give you my answers in response to that contest. All right, man. Usually I would use a tripod for this or uh, it's a little bit farther away from the camera, but just trying to, uh, to roll with it. I'm looking at the computer here. So we have to name our favorite movie, favorite athlete, and favorite video game of all time. So the... Sorry, my dog is completely nuts. Favorite athlete, obviously, Ken Griffey Jr. There's no question about it. Any sport, any era, it's Ken Griffey Jr. Um, I don't want to bore everybody with that. You know that's my favorite player. Um, there's a lot of reasons why. I think he's a great man on the field and off the field. He's not just a good, talented player. You know, obviously 630 home runs. His batting average didn't end up being 300, and he didn't get the 3,000 hits. But he's played the game the right way. He hustled his ass off, but he had fun. I had fun. I was that guy on the team always having fun. But not being a clown, I was a very serious player, but I like to have fun. I think that's very important to enjoy what you do. And then off the field, he's a good father. Um, obviously, he took after his father, who was a very good man off the field, does a lot of charity work and stuff. That's important to me. So I like the guy on the field, off the field, Ken Griffey Jr., hands down. So. Anyway, next is the movie. I'm going to show you something real quick. All right, I think it was Scootley just said this in his video response, the same thing, but he was talking about like having digital videos and stuff. I try to convert all my DVDs to digital or just buy a digital copy because I don't want to have a thousand DVDs around here. So my collection's pretty intense. It's a little bit messy here, so sorry about that. Um, so you can see right here, like this screen, for example, this hard drive right here, this little guy right there with uh, that right there. Got to read what it says there with my awesome handwriting. This is movies only, local drive, folders, uh, USB 1. So let's see, like scroll down here, you see right there, there's 916 files on here. And these, like Trailer Park Boys, my favorite show of all time, freaking hilarious. I got Gumby, you know, I got Gumby on there for the kids. I got The Office, the UK version, Discovery Channel, ESPN 3030, you know, just to show you right, right there. Every movie, all 30. That's going to play. Hopefully I got it muted. But anyway, you get the point. Um, but that's the folders, you know? So I got that. You scroll through here. Stop any random movie. I got movies that I don't like, movies that I don't watch, movies that I love. You see them as I scroll. Just stop randomly. Boom. The Day After Tomorrow, 2004. The Day the Earth Stood Still. The Dilemma. The Duchess. Emperor's New Groove. I mean, you name it, it's on here. All genres. All good movies, bad movies, whatever. Godfather 1, 2. Uh, that's two part, Godfather 3, you know, it's all on there. So, anyway, I got all these movies. I got 916 plus on here because that folder only counts as one. And then I got these right here, watch out, pup, which are music and movies. So, I got all those, but anyway, back to the question. So, favorite movie of all time to answer that is going to be uh, Little Big League. <laughs> I know, shocker. Love Dumb and Dumber, love the funny movies, stupid funny movies are awesome, although I'm not a Will Ferrell fan, I think his movies are pretty terrible overall, he's had a couple good ones, but not a big fan of his, but I love the kind of silly, stupid, uh, funny movies, love 80s movies, Top Gun, Breakfast Club, stuff like that, but Little Big League, if you guys don't remember, the kid inherits the twins, and the anti-hero from you guys that paid attention to English class, um, or the, well, there's other words for it, doesn't matter, it's not an English class, anyway. He is, uh, Ken Griffey Jr. is the anti-hero, so he ruins the, like the end of the movie, he's the reason like they don't win it all and go to the World Series and stuff like that, and Randy Johnson's in it as himself, um, who else is in it? There's a lot of good players, I want to say like Frank Thomas or something like that, maybe Jose can say, there's some like big time players from that uh, era in the 90s, but Griffey's in there a couple times, he's a little bit like uh, kind of cocky, but uh, just a badass in the movie, so it's kind of funny, because it's as a kid, it was a baseball movie, sort of like... Uh, like Rookie of the Year, kind of that type of feel, but it's got real baseball players, not fake ones in it, and Griffey's the man in it, so awesome. Freaking love that. The last thing he wanted to know was our favorite video game. So as far as a common video game now, I really do not play video games, but NCAA football is my game. Got an Xbox 360. I just bought this. I'm Marshall, obviously. I played the WVU game, which turned out differently than it did in real life. I won the game. 
on Heisman level. I rarely ever play video games and I still want it. So that's why it gets boring to me because I always win and that's boring. Now Xbox Live would be cool, but I don't play it enough to go buy the subscription, so there's no point to it. But anyway, this is my favorite modern game. My favorite game of all time. It's going to be kind of weird. There is a game called, for Sega Genesis, Toe Jam and Earl. It was a fat alien and a skinny alien. Uh, Earl was the fat one. Toe Jam was a three-legged red alien. They were from a different planet and they crashed and whatever. And you find, like, presents and gifts and stuff like that. You guys that remember that, for whatever reason, that is my favorite game of all time, by far. I have no idea why. I did play it again when I was an adult because I was like, I wonder if this game was actually terrible. But I still loved it. It was weird. It's not like any other game I played. I'm not really into those like fantasy type games and stuff. I really play sports games, if anything. But that's my game, Toe Jam and Earl. So Ken Griffey Jr., Little Big League, Toe Jam and Earl. Please sub to Huff Boy RD. Got the link below. Check them out in the contest. Please get them subs. Thanks.